Don't be afraid. Could you help me? I'm in need of some info. I promise, that's all. Thanks. Appreciate it. Flycatcher. That is it. All right, it's nothing a shot of tequila can't fix, all right? Listen, we gotta change your plans. We need to get you some help sooner rather than later. Take me to South Cape Station. There are people there that can help.
Jesus. The bleeding's not stopping. Just keep pressure on it. Hey, stay awake. I'm awake. I'm awake. Now, those nasty drones I just fought, did you design them? Partly. The flycatcher, he customizes his own drones. He's an amateur engineer. He, he'll change out a turbine, adjust the programmed behavior. Yeah, yeah. He's smart. He's dangerous. Flycatcher was my personal jailer for months. He's... Um... He's one of Walker's alpha wolves. I think you know the type. Me? Stay with me, Paula. Stay awake. What makes Flycatcher dangerous, huh? Why is he so badass? When one of my engineers disappeared, there was a rumor that Flycatcher abducted her. I'm not sure why, but knowing what Wallace was working on, it can't be good. The Flycatcher sounds like somebody I should track down. Yes. Please do. And be sure to hurt his feelings for me. Yeah, I'm sure I'll come up with a witty insult. Listen, was Wallace at that R&D lab we just left? No, sh she was... She was staying in the Grandview Mansion when she went missing. Paula. Paula, stay awake. We're almost there. Hey! Hey! Stay awake! Hey, this woman needs help. She says she knew a doctor here. Paula! Take her to medical. Come on. I'll be all right. You're the, um, outcasts. It's not like we chose that name. It makes us sound like a biker gang. Yeah. Something like that. I guess all the good terrorist names were taken, huh? We are not terrorists. They never are. They're always freedom fighters, revolutionaries, political activists. And who are you, exactly? I'm Nomad. And right now I'm looking out for Paula Madeira. You're one of the soldiers from the helicopters. That's right. We tried to help some of you, but... We only found dead bodies. Why would you try to help us out? Because we need friends. Even if they do look like the Brute Squad. <laughs> the world is more dangerous to humans than ever. I'm Haruhito. I used to be an engineer at Skeltech and I was happy, but... Then some of us found out a Skeltech secret. Project Deus? Never heard of it. You've heard of transhumanism? Some of the scientists on this island want to force the next step of human evolution with technology. Project Deus wants to make computers that are more intelligent than humans. <laughs> well, that shouldn't be too difficult. Most people I meet are as dumb as rocks. Would you really want a computer running your life? We came to live here because J. Skell promised us a libertarian paradise. Project Deus would put computers in control. And now you're here to fight that. Damn right. And Paula Madeira is a friend of yours. You'd be surprised how many people think transhumanism is a shitty goal. You can visit Paula in the medical bay. I've been hearing that a bunch of drones attack some civilians. You like music, Nomad? Sure, I guess. I mean, who doesn't? Did you know we have a famous musician right here on the island? Wait, really? I mean, who's not famous on this island? 
Good point. His name is Jesus Morrison. For the last few years, he's been covertly working with us, encoding enemy intel in his songs. That sounds like a dangerous assignment. I would appreciate you paying him a visit. He's been under some unwelcome scrutiny. Duly noted. I've been hearing that a bunch of drones attack some civilians. Brute Squad. Did you mean what you said about needing friends? I did. We just got intel about a new shipment of weapons at some base in Oroa. The weapons are being sent to Liberty by boat. Hey, you want me to hijack it and bring it back for your people? You should have quit while you were ahead. Hey, we aren't the real enemy. Right now, the enemy isn't even Project Deus. Sentinel is coming for all of us. We need weapons. Every legitimate revolution had to start somewhere. But arming concerned citizens is a long way from a real liberation army. We're in it now. Knowing what we do, there's no turning away. Those weapons are the only chance we've got at getting supplies and defending ourselves. What else do you know about the shipment? Not much. It's being loaded onto a boat and it's headed to Liberty. There's not much to go on, but it's all our contact could get. That's plenty. I can go find myself a Sentinel soldier for anything else. I'll grab the boat and meet you with the shipment. You don't know the half of it. A bunch of my friends got strafed. I mean, they're in real bad shape. How can I help you today? Revolution, Brute Squad. Don't tell me you've never caused one. It was the number two turn-on in Uniform Chaser magazine. Some soldier boy break your heart? So many assumptions, so little time. Point is, we could use some help on the front lines. You're not soldiers, Harui. Well, the cavalry's not coming. We're what you've got. Now, Sentinel's got a new drone prototype that's keeping us up at night, and it's about to enter a new phase of testing. Enough said. I'll intercept the transport detail to make sure it never gets where it's going. Did your buddies do anything to provoke it? Hey, Nomad. What do you know about data security? A little. Why? One of Sentinel's sector bosses, Mark Meridian, has gotten a hold of a scale algorithm that analyzes phone, email, and social media patterns. There's probably a lot of sensitive data in that mess. Yes. The algorithm takes advantage of online vulnerabilities. Once verified, it can be uploaded to the cloud where everybody in Sentinel can access it. With the data, Meridian can target outcast agents and their families. So where do I fit into all of this? Later today, Meridian and his three lieutenants are meeting to verify their intel and start the algorithm protocols. I'm hoping you can stop them. Listen, I'm not your private assassin. I know. But listen, Meridian and his men are heartless. With this info, not only are the outcasts in grave danger, but so are their loved ones. Okay. Okay, I'll see what I can do. Where should I start looking? One of his goons, Sullivan Blake, was last seen on the eastern side of the Good Hope Mountain province. It's north of the God Forsaken Highland. Red Weasel Outpost is around there. After you track him down, he should lead you to the others. Got it. No. They were just minding their own business, just taking out the damn trash. Been for hearing Pete's that a bunch sake. of drones I mean, attacks some more civilians. Mortifying to live in fear of these drones. I should never have helped make those drones. Guess I'm paying for my sins. Uh, they didn't give you much choice. Yeah. 
Painkillers make me think too much. <laughs> I know you want something. Everybody's after me like I'm bell of the ball. I'm working with Jay Skull. He's alive? He's alive. And he needs your help, Paula. Why would I help him? Jace did this. This is all him. Let's just say he's seen the light. And he wants to fix things. But he can't do it alone. I trusted him when I followed him out to this godforsaken island, and he lied to all of us. He betrayed us. I'm sorry. But if you trust Jay Skell, you are just as stupid as we were. <clears throat> Paula. You know he's not working for Sentinel, right? He was. You should ask him what they were working on. Ask him about Project Deus. Hey, did you find Paula? Sure, but she won't come here. She kind of hates me right now. <laughs> you, uh, kind of didn't mention that. I thought she'd be over that. Things ought to roll the way they are. Hope she'd help us out. Once I said your name, she wouldn't even talk to me. What's Project Deus? Project Deus isn't the problem. The problem is, she can only see the harm it can do. Great to see you again. Great to see you too, sir. Lieutenant Colonel Walker, Paula Madeira. Please, call me Cole. Paula is Skeltech's most brilliant engineer. Now, now, I've seen your uh, designs, ma'am. I'd say that brilliant, that's an understatement. And I've seen your resume. It's heavily redacted. <laughs> Yeah. So I take it that, uh, that's not for the field test. No, that won't be ready for a few months. Wow. I want to ask you, the, uh, work you're doing on deep learning AI controlling these drones, how's that going? Excuse me? Using deep learning AI? How? Specifically, uh, Data mining, target identification. We haven't um, explored those options yet. <laughs> you mean to tell me that you have the top computer scientists in the world developing some sort of supercomputer and you uh, haven't explored those options yet? He's talking about Maddox. He's talking about Project Deus. Imagine it. Using this beast of a computer for predictive analytics. Finding terror threats, eliminating them with drones. You want to build a super intelligent computer, and the first thing you want to do with it is kill people? Oh, man. First thing I want to do is keep the free world safe. I'm sure that you, uh, well, you understand that. And who's going to keep the free world safe from Project Deus? <laughs> How could you? I want nothing to do with this. 
don't... Just... Paul! <laughs> Jace. If she's truly brilliant, she'll come around. So you and Walker were pals, huh? Everyone was... Nomad. We need Paula's help. No one knows the system better than she does. I like you, genius. But some of your choices get people hurt. All the big choices do. Look, I know how to get her to help us. I'm listening. Two things. You need to find evidence on the explosion in my lab. You really know who did it? I'm almost certain the outcast did it. But you need to show Paula evidence on the explosive device itself. Second, you need to visit Paula's husband. She did not mention a husband. Look for him in a rural hospital. Nomad. This won't be easy for her. But after it's done, she'll know who to trust. All right. We need her help. We're falling behind because of the roadblocks. So how are you faring with the blockades? What can I do to help? You can make sure Sentinel doesn't come knocking with weaponized drones. That mean you're willing to work together? It means I won't make a good ally dead, so you might as well help until I decide what to do. Fair enough. I can get onto their servers and wipe any data I find about you and your people. Peachy. Just make sure you're ready. Grab some help if you need it. Hello there. Can you give me a little more information about this? That's all the information. Thanks. Take care of yourself. Going someplace? Sentinel patrols are getting close. We need to relocate. You must have heard them pretty bad to have them come after you. What's an outfit like that doing on a row anyway? There was that bombing on Skeltech. I've heard of it. I haven't heard too many details. What do you know? I'm sorry, Nomad. I'm very busy. Excuse me. Taikoro's hiding something. Let's need to find out what. Tore up. 
up the R&D center. So it's damn outcasts, man. Gotta be in the head. Let Skell slip away, then Skell's the wolf's problem. The ghost, too. That's how I see it.
darn decent when that bomb went off. I, just, I can't believe the outcasts would try so much. Are you all right? Yeah, I'm in one piece. I found a workshop. Maybe it was yours. There were some blueprints Paula had drawn. There isn't time. That Sentinel platoon took some of our supplies. Critical supplies. We won't survive without them. Please, help us get them back and take them to our rally point. Yeah, fine. But I'm hanging on to these documents. battery power here to blow up the entire island. Where the hell is that son of a bitch, Daigoro? He went to the South Cape Whaling Station to see his sister. Well, what's wrong? Don't worry. Daigoro will hear all about it. fighting in a guerrilla war. 
Where's your worm over, brother? Nomad, are you okay? Oh, wait, wait! <laughs> you piece of shit. You tell a motherfucker when you have him chase down a truck full of explosives. Or were you trying to kill me? Huh? Uh, uh, What's up with these blueprints? You mean engineering? Or you just bombed the shit out of dirty people? Don't hurt him! Please, just let me explain! Don't tell me this was your idea. Now wait. Just You're wait. a fucking terrorist and you tried to blow my ass up! It was a mistake, okay? He got scared. The building was supposed to be empty. The lab was supposed to be empty. We were given bad information. You two are idiots. So are all the rest of your outcasts. The future must be human. Project Deus wants to make computers that's smarter than we are. What about Paula Madeira? Hmm? She give you those blueprints? No. Daigoro figured out how to use her energy cells as an incendiary device. We kept it secret from her. Especially after we killed those people. Paula is too important to us. Are you still gonna kill us? Stupid is as bad as evil. But with Sentinel out there, I need you. Still, I'm gonna tell Paula what you and your sister did. Brute Squad, tell her I'm sorry. I've been hearing that a bunch of drones attack some civilians. How can I help you today? Listen, it's all out war. One side's gonna die from a thousand cuts, but they've got blood to spare. And well, you're the resident expert. And you want my help in this rebellion? You sure your people are ready for that fight? They will be, because they have to be. Today, Sentinel's shipping a drone prototype to a test site on the back of a truck. Probably the type of party I ought to crash. See? I know you. But be careful. This isn't gonna be easy. In fact, if you've got any favors to call in, now would be a great time. I'll see what I can do. You don't know the half of it. A bunch of my friends got strafed. I mean, they're in real bad shape. Did your buddies do anything to provoke it? No. They were just minding their own business. Did your buddies do anything to provoke it? No. They were just minding their own business. Just taking out the damn trash for Pete's sake. I mean... Hey, you. Leave me alone. I don't have energy for a fight. Look, I'm not here to fight. But I have to tell you. Haruhi and Daigoro. They bombed that Skeltech lab. I heard the rumors. But Haruhi and Daigoro would never hurt anyone. You know, 
they didn't mean to. But they did. I always thought... I don't know. Someone was trying to set them up. Make them look like terrorists. And they used one of your energy cells as the bomb. Digora was able to adapt the technology. And Sentinel... They figured out how to do the same thing. Oh, hell. <laughs> you gonna be okay? You know that phrase, the truth will set you free? Yeah, I've read it. It's not true. Maybe I should have sided with the AI. At least your computer program's consistent. People always let you down. You can rely on people more than you think, Paula. You'd be surprised. 